a stick. X seed. There's like weird RPG elements in this actually. Oh. You didn't know that? Bamco and I. Yeah. Did you do not know this was a Bamco game? No, I didn't actually. Doesn't X seed do story of seasons or are they the ones who took over the bad harvest moon? I don't remember. They do a couple things. Yes, yeah, you it's like god, it's so quiet. <sighs> it's so pretty. All right. I'm going to turn the volume up just a little bit. All right. And big decision time. Yeah. Which one? Which what are we playing in? There's huh? French. Huh? This, this has this is Japanese audio. Do you want do you want it? I think for my sake as well as the sake of the people who would prefer to have English audio, we should do English audio. You can play it in Japanese on your own time, dude. I know, but I forget the voice actor, but I know you'd be really excited. I think Emil- I think Johnny Young Bosch is in this. That should have been the tip off for me. I don't know if, what these words mean, but- That it was a Bamco game because Johnny Young Bosch, back in the day, was in pretty much every Bamco game. Alright. Now he's in pretty Wait, much- I didn't actually look at any of the- Oh. Oh no! <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> well- Calibrate. Uh, oh, this doesn't have an in-game slider. This is back well, when they were like, get off your butt and do it on your TV yourself. It looks fine to me. Wait, I what is see... it? Adjust the settings on your TV so that the three shapes in the middle appear as squares. I can see squares. Yeah, they, they look like squares. I don't think there were any other settings that were worrisome. It was defaulted in English, so... Yeah, I got the got the cicadas. At the very end of a summer that was all too short, the old man I was living with passed away. Even after all the years we spent together, I never knew his name. Later that evening, I dug a shallow grave in the front yard of our home and buried him there. Yeah, that's his Emil At voice. That moment, mm -hmm. I was truly alone. It's very fitting for this character. Absolutely. Just based on what little I remember. It's a very good Maybe I'll find something he left behind. It's so Maybe. dark I can hardly see. If I crank open the dome, then I can let in some moonlight. Oh, tutorial start! Stop! Uh, yeah, okay. It's fla- <laughs> It's flashing! What's that? That has such- Fatal Frame 3 vibes that I can't- Yeah, see, I have a stick. Do you have a flashlight or do you have a laser pointer? Um, I don't have a flashlight yet, I don't think. So you have a magic laser pointer. I suppose. I suppose that's what that is. Mm-hmm. Sick. I like how the overall lighting of the room has not changed, though. I... Hold on. Okay. <laughs> I forgot what kind of vaguely point and click this is, actually, also. A 3D point and click. Oh, you're gonna read those? Not entirely. Uh, I think that's just cabbage. The bottom one's cabbage. Kabetsu, kabetsu, kabetsu. Lettuce! Please. Why is it vibrating? Because there's something to look at. Oh. I've always wondered what this weird box was. Millennials looking at it CRTs. Like We're just talking about that. Uh. No, he doesn't care about that. Yeah. Yeah, 
I won't light. Oh. Okay, so I think it vibrates specifically when I'm hovering over something. Something of interest? Yeah, and then I can, like, zoom in to do that. Okay. I think that's the case. Can I really go up here? Yes. More boxes. Please. That's Petey. Interesting. Bakiti. 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 I'm not sure if they're what they are exactly. Something well, we over there. But we sure do know that his grandpa liked cabbages. I'll look it up later. I'm not gonna stop right now. That gradient in the sky is so pretty. Yeah, the, this game is very pretty. There's so many I really like when people use colors that aren't just blue and a darker blue and then black. Like Animal Crossing perfected that. There's just splashes of all sorts of colors in there. Oh, okay. Sorry. I was listening to you, but I was also very confused momentarily. Do what you gotta do. It just seems like a very ob like obtuse way of getting to your bed. Yeah, a little bit. Whoa. 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 Yeah, there's the flashlight. Hey, look. <laughs> it's his flashlight. Uh huh. You got the flashlight. Hell yeah. God, it's gonna be a struggle to see. What? My inventory. You got a flashlight. Light it up. Handy. Check it out. <laughs> <laughs> this game is very sad. I feel like that might have looked a little bit more natural, like, with kanji. But in English, it just looks kind of funny. I think it would be interested enough if I actually put it in kanji. I should also check it out. That's the most Link-sounding slash from a character that isn't Link I've ever heard. He's very beat. Do it again. Yeah. I like the little line. And there's yeah. a way to turn your you know, it's crouching. I'm pretty sure there's a way to turn your light off, but I forget what it is right now. Yeah. Honestly the cabbage one is very fun because the end part makes the sue. And it just looks very it's nice. Stylized. Yeah. <clears throat> I don't think turning off the flashlight is relevant right now though, so they'll probably tell me how to do it later. Are there enemies yes in this game yay that's why i have a stick you fight things in this game it has the function of turning off the flashlight sneaking uh kind of okay oh that's... i guess i'll see when we get to it okay. that one also won't... yes okay i don't think there's anything else in here oh, it actually looks like it it's the archives you <gasps> Kitty! Kitty! Oh, 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 where are they going? Where? Where did they go? Kitty? Oh my god! Oh! oh. They're following me. Hello, Kitty. No. No, don't! I'm not trying to. I think they're just behind me. Yeah? Oh, oh there they are. I was gonna say their eyes are glowing. They're just wandering around, I guess. Oh, I think they're leading me somewhere. Oh, that's so good. Or they're not. I don't know. I'm gonna wander around and I'll figure out what the kitty's doing. They, um, they made sure that the glow effect was only active when you're not shining the flashlight on them. Oh, here we go. Which is how cat eyes actually work. Or so Stubborn I've been told. Things. I thought they were all dead, but I see at least one survived. Hello? Yeah? <laughs> Can I help you? Oh! <gasps> oh yeah, there's... You didn't tell me this was a scary game? I explicitly... <laughs> That's fair. Oh no. Well timed attacks. There are also invisible enemies called thought entities. Mm -hmm. I'm a thought entity. You told me not. <laughs> Ash at the very beginning. Okay, you can swear, just don't be not safe for work. I said we can be little uh, not safe for work. I just said don't go too oh, ham. Yeah. 
It said well timed. It did it though. So what is the timing exactly? I I don't know. I don't remember. How pathetic. Such a useless creature. <laughs> That's also fair. <laughs> what what are you? I do not have to answer to you. This has been a great conversation. <laughs> Alright, um... Damn. Let's just... Let's go read our dead... Maybe father figure diary. By the time... You read this... I'll already... Be gone. Mm -hmm. Dear sister. Before, <laughs> I didn't really care if I was dead or alive. I never considered myself worthy of living. Yeah, there's a lot of existential dread in this game. Just awful. I I play Persona Three. I'm ready. Even death could atone for my sins. You see the shooting star? No. <gasps> oh, pretty. You have no idea how hard it was for me to even write you this letter. It's strange, really. For having wasted so much of my life. Now that the end is finally in sight. Oh, is that a height chart? I never dreamed I'd feel like this. I'll have to look at that after if I'm allowed to. Only the time I yeah. spent with you gave meaning to my worthless life. Oh, Grandpa. Only mm. now do I regret that I didn't open my heart to you more. Why is it, as I say goodbye, that I'm brimming with so many things I wish I could have said to you? Please forgive this foolish old man. Head east of here, and you will reach a tall red tower. Prince of Mineral Town remake is weird. Us, but there, <laughs> you <laughs> this might old dead man is pouring his heart out, and that's what you yourself. have to say. Mm hmm When I am gone, you must go east. Now go. And Seto. And Seto. Thank you. For everything. Shout out to that one person that came in to do three lines. It's interesting. Um, usually when a character is reading a letter, it, it starts with their voice and fades into the narrative voice of the person who wrote the letter, then fades back out. So pretty. <laughs> oh, we're gonna have to mute this, huh? Maybe? I don't remember this at all. It feels very Ghibli-esque. That's not good. They really did put her in that outfit, huh? Yeah, I have no idea why. I don't actually remember anything about her. Well, we know why. <laughs> Listen. Because old men are gross. I know you kids love nature taking things back. Yeah. It's great. It's cool. I like that we're 16 minutes into the game and still know virtually nothing about what's happening. Well, our grandpa died, and yeah. the world seems bad. Yeah. And he used the word survivors, so mm -hmm. something happened, clearly. Oh, yeah, of course. But I'm saying that's not necessarily a bad thing. Oh, yeah. I'm so still interested, even though they've barely told us anything, which means they're doing something right. Good night. God, could you have given her some pants at least? some tights she's basically sleeping outside a blanket can't we can't ruin the artist's integrity the artist's integrity 
That's what that is? I can't even get through that. <laughs> oh boy. The Eiffel Tower? No. All right. See, this is what I remember most from this game. Like, just nighttime and also being in... Not the sewer. There's a underground. Lot. Um, we do go to an underground mall relatively soon. Oh my god. Sorry, the camera just keeps doing that. That's okay. Is there but... anything I can do with you, little kitty? Or are you just here to be a kitty? I think that's why I was so jarred by that opening. Because I didn't remember seeing anything of daytime. Are those, like, glowing lily pads? Yes. Oh. I was trying to read what that sign said. Truly precious you can be. I look into your eyes and softly touch your hand. Farewell, love, and tomorrow we will meet again. Oh, twinkling star above, how beautiful yet lonesome. As sad and lonesome as I am I reach out for your hand We are two and one Farewell, my love <laughs> Oh no, you were on the song <laughs> Oh Ouchy, ouch Oh my god Are you okay? Do you have a concussion? <laughs> Hey, are you all are right? You okay? <laughs> I hope she's not dead. <laughs> you touched me. <laughs> yeah, but well, I was just making sure you were still alive. I don't know you. Mm-hmm. Well, no. But I'm... <laughs> no, that... That's... Damn right. I, I know that, I know that like... You've been wandering this no, wasteland wait. for what's don't implied go. to be a couple days and not seen anyone since. But you do still need to, like, ask people. <laughs> yeah, see, that's On the underground. journey through the world, all of the people I thought I saw slipped away like they were just a mirage but that girl her cheek was warm to the touch she was a real person so two things one why the heck did that sandal squeak like a bath toy two that that's pretty much the appropriate response if someone you don't know cradles your cheek i was 15 years old at the end of that summer The Eiffel Tower. Please that warning stop this. <laughs> changed my lonely world in ways I never could have imagined. The brief moment we shared transformed me to my very core. Even now, I remember it like it was just yesterday. The stuffy, humid air, the last vestige of summer. Your silver hair fluttering in the breeze. Big silver moon. That sandal that squeaked like a bath toy. <laughs> You're just gonna hold on to that, aren't you? Yeah, I am. All right, we got some posters. Oh wow, they just dropped us here. Okay. I try to look at things and the game says no. <laughs> Help me. I am in danger of malfunctioning. Here they I'm are. not completely waterproof. Please help me. Is someone there? Yes, over here. I am 
That's my iPhone when I bring it into the bathroom with me and I'm taking a really steamy shower. Yes. Correct. Find it. I'm trying. Play the game. Oh my god. Oh, there's there's <laughs> voice. Yeah. I hope that's off because I hate that. Um, I know how to turn it off if it isn't. Okay. But okay. Can I can I finish looking at things? So that's that's a drawing. Is that pickle Rick? Please. <laughs> I'm begging you. Is that graffiti only appearing when you shine your flashlight on it? Which one? The one behind you. Um, no. move closer to it. Okay, now move the flashlight away. No, it's- it's okay. there, it just- I was just curious. Oh, there's more. <laughs> That's a face. Oh. Is it just the station name, or? Oh, well, um, it's welcoming us to the area. Ah. Oh. Please help me. I'm in danger of malfunctioning. Anyone? It's coming from the other side. If I crouch down, I should be able to squeeze through. I don't want to do that. The game's going to tell me, though. <laughs> yes. Correct. Yeah. Oh, my God. The camera just shifts yeah. weirdly. I don't really know how to fix it. How do you control the camera? With if the you, stick? If you press C, it seems to like go back, but every now and then it will just like wildly flip to somewhere else. It's kind of annoying. Uh, it could be our nunchuck. <laughs> could be the game being janky. I'm just also really bad at controlling <laughs> Wii games, so it could also just be me. Maybe it's, it's all not three. From over here. Oh, okay. <laughs> The game is like, no. You have an objective. Okay, but there's literally like, oh, oh. that's the way I came. Uh, what about that right there? What even is that? Is that like a fire pit? It looks like a fire pit, but I can't do anything with it. Hmm. Warning, I am not completely waterproof. Please help me. I am in serious danger of malfunction. Warning. I am not completely waterproof. This is extremely dangerous. Oh, that's fine. Oh, it looked way bigger. Hello. I am a personal frame. An interactive digital assistant equipped to respond to my user's emotional state. Whatever it may be. Oh, get ready. Hey there, my name is... Uh, whoa! Let us save introductions for later. We are in danger in our current location. I will quickly navigate a route to safety for us. A route? Navigate? <laughs> we must hurry. I love when anime characters just repeat First, words out of the sentence that was just spoken to them. And in this case, I'm like, does he oh, just not know what those words mean? Did you fasten my sides until they made a clicking sound? You mean these here? He was waxing poetic in the last cutscene, though. I guess that could have been in the future. I was about to say, that was implied to be in the future. Oh, PF for short. I love you, PF. My primary function is analyzing whatever situation my user is in and offering a sound solution. I wish my brain did that. <laughs> yeah, that sounds like what a functioning <laughs> brain ought to do, yeah? Of course. Uh. However, there is more I must tell you about later. We're gonna die if we stay in this room. Do you know what it's like to have a functioning brain? You you have like talked to me, right? We, yeah. We've been friends for a very long time, right? Mm, yeah, a little bit. <laughs> it might open. I just want to see if there's anything else in here. I wish Silent Hill games had a prompt like Ooh, that. Hold on. Oh well. I'm pretty sure it's just a train schedule. It looks like a little jellyfish, man. Oh yeah, there was a draw. That was what I was looking at on there. But I mean, like the 
board itself is just a little. You should be able to build a fire there. 